Okay, so what am I doing today on this nice day when it's snowing everywhere else? Okay, I took that jack off of the trailer because it just wasn't getting it very well. And they had one on either side. What well, also looks like there used to be a jack here of some sort. And I got this new one here I want to put on. Well, normally you would grind the spot, stick that on there and weld this inside piece right to the frame. But this isn't a perfect fit, but it's close enough that I think I'm just going to stick it in there and weld it. Okay, now I've got that thing stuck in there and I got it welded all the way around there. So what we're going to do now is we're going to weld this thing on there. Okay, so this part will just slip right on there and it'll give you a pin that goes right with it. And you can turn this to raise the jack up and down. Okay, that way it gets it out of your way. And then this goes right around it like that. And then you just weld this right on, this piece on there. Now, I'm going to knock the paint off of it. Now, here's the thing. I could weld it on, like right there where it's at. And I'd be that high off the ground. But this pin, if you pull it, this will drop down quite a bit. And if you was ever someplace and the front of your truck was up or something, you was lower, you'd be messed up. So what I'm going to do is raise this up to where the sticker is almost even. Somewhere in there. And then that's where I'm going to weld it. That way it will give us plenty of room. And I know there's plenty of down travel. So, Okay, now what I've done is I've held this up on there. And I kind of made some marks where I want to grind the paint off. Because that's all I want to grind. I don't want to grind it all off. So I'll grind this paint off of here. Right around the edge of this. Okay, so you can see the two lines there. I just took the paint off of where I needed to. So now I'm going to get this on there. And I'll take a C-clamp and clamp this tight. Now what I've done, I've just clamped that together to squeeze it tight and take up any little bit of gap. Now I'll just run a little bead around here. Okay, so what I've done here, I welded that on there. Okay. And now I can just take this. Slide that right up on there. <laughs> if you put the pin in this direction, the jack will be up, or you can spin it back here like this and put the jack up to travel. So, let me um, get a little paint on them welds and then, now all I done was just spray a little silver paint I had on there and um, a little black on the frame. So, there it is. See, I got the foot out one notch down here. So that'll leave me a lot of room to jack it down or go up whichever way I need to go. So there's one trailer jack installed.